Welcome back. You with Expresso here on SABC3. Now, this week in Cape Town, it's Fashion Week from the 13th to the 16th of July. And in studio with us, we've got someone who's very fashionable. She has a blog uh, all about Cape Town street fashion. Her real name is Sam Walker, a.k.a. Lemuse, or on Twitter, at popyourcollar123, popyourcollar.co.za. Sam, welcome to Expresso. Hello, thanks very much. And right next to Sam, a man who knows everything when it comes to men's fashion, Mike, the creative director from Fabiani. Good morning, welcome to Expresso. Good morning, how are you doing? Good, Good to be here. nice to be here. We've created our own runway here on Expresso, and we're just getting into the whole theme of Fashion Week. It and all seems you've amazing, you've just great being here. Yes. Now, 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 you've got one of them, we've, you've dressed a few models in some of the, the clothes that we can expect to see on Saturday at the Fabiani Collection. I do, it's just a bit of a, bit of a sort of uh, something very, very little because we don't let the cat out of the bag. Mm -hmm. um, it's going to be a great show on Saturday evening. It's going to be a spectacular show. Uh, we've kind of done a homework in the sense of what we want to show. Uh, we do cater for the Fabiani men, and I think that's very important. Uh, yeah, so we have, what we've done is we've got four great looks, which is the one would be the resort look. Mm -hmm. Should uh, we get the resort look out? Uh, excuse the me. The resort look coming out, is this the resort look? Yeah, well, this is actually the colourful college. Mm -hmm. What we've done is uh, we've taken the old-fashioned college look and uh, we've kind of changed it to more of a colourful look, put it that way. Uh, you know, it's a boy and every man, so this man looks very good. I mean, he looks colourful and he looks college -y. On set, we would call this the Katlejo look. Well, because Katlejo loves his bow tie and he likes going for the college look. He looks look. absolutely amazing, his bow tie, even today. <laughs> good stuff. And yeah. um, men's fashion, you've seen a change over the last couple of years as well. Yes, definitely. I think a couple of years ago it was something lacking in South Africa, but now, I mean, you know, becoming internationally, I mean, the world's becoming smaller and smaller. I think South Africa is becoming like spot on. And as you can see, I mean, they've got the train, they've got a bit of yellow, bright colour, lovely tailored blue, navy blue jacket. I mean, he's going for the yacht kind of classic um, look, and I think mm. they've got it spot on. Very good. And our next model? Uh, the next model, where he comes out. It's always a surprise here. It's like well, fashion, you can never always, know what you're going yeah, to expect. Yeah, huh. There we go. Oh, I love that hat. Oh, the oh, Well, that's Metro in the uh, mm -hmm. resort look, which uh, what we've done is we've taken the, Fabi the Fabiani man out of the boardroom and we've kind of jazz him up. It's like having a holiday in, on, in the Capri or some faraway resort. That's what we've done. And we've created the new Panama. And what we've done is we've touched with a little bit of a smart jacket, which is obviously fitted, and we've jazzed up the old-fashioned chino. Uh, which, which looks amazing and it looks a lot more modern than many years ago. Now Sam, as a, as a lady, you've dressed and, and you've been behind the scenes dressing some stylish men. Uh, what advice do you have for women who want to dress their men? Well, I think this season it's all about colour. I mean, colours everywhere. The brighter, the better. It's also about neon colours. And as well, I'm seeing a lot of pastels colours come through. So if ever there was a season to get your man into colour, this is the season. So bright colour shirts, <laughs> bright colour Panama hats, everything. Have fun with it. We see, I've seen a dark, uh, this is not bright at all though. No, well, this, this is that this is, uh, chic, you know, Mr. Mr. GQ man, if yes. you're looking for one. <laughs> this is probably only goes to dinner. Mm -hmm. uh, what you've done is you've taken the, the old-fashioned once again. You've transformed it, the old-fashioned dinner suit. We give it a more of a silhouette with the centre vent at the back. Uh, we try to jazz up with the, the big hat, which is a big brimmed hat, which is very Paris, as you can see. Mm -hmm. uh, and it's, 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 a, it's a great feeling, but what we're going to do for the collection is we're going to uh, cash it with a bit of colour. Oh. Because obviously, like we explained, Lego colours and neon colours are huge at the moment in Europe, and we look at global trends. So, and we brought it back home, so this is what we're going to do. So this is just a taste before what you're going to see for, you know, in the entire collection. It's uh, going to be, there's going to be a lot more colour added to it. Than that way. Yeah. Sam, are South African men brave enough to experiment with colour and to experiment with hats? Yes, I think, I think now, I mean, that's what's so nice about Cape Town Fashion Week. I think if you walk in the street, I take a lot of street style pics, the fashionistas are very few and far. But during Cape Town Fashion Week, you're going to see a lot of men, fashionista guys, mm -hmm. wearing bright coloured suits, bright colour, 
Yeah, it's a, it's a season to be colourful. Mm -hmm. Any other sneak peeks that we can expect from the show? I know well, you've got another model coming up. No, uh, no there, there has to be three of them. There has to be a surprise. Obviously, on Saturday evening, I expect a spectacular show. <laughs> I think the entire Fashion Week, Cabin Fashion Week, is always a dream and it's always amazing. Uh, uh, with Fabiani, we hope to put up a good show. So, yeah, like you can expect lots of colour. Mm. Uh, the neon look is going to be huge in the collection, so you can expect that. So, yeah, there's going to be lots of happiness. And, and for the ladies, lots of hot. What do you mean, looking hot for Fabiani? <laughs> Always. We, we try. Once we do the casting with the model, we see that we get the better looking guys to do mm. the job. So, yeah, ladies, do come to the show and please come and have a look inside at evening at 7. Come on, tell me what happens at those castings. Do the guys have to take their shirts off for you? What really goes on behind Well, we don't. I don't know the boys, but what I'm trying to say is obviously. They, they actually try and do that. They mm. try and show their six back and physiques most of the time. Mm. So we can take them and use them in Fabiani. But uh, we have one or two very familiar faces who's worked for us before. So, <laughs> yeah, uh, yeah, we go for the better looking ones because that's right. So. Thank you so much, guys. You look awesome. Sam, what else can we expect from Fashion Week? It's not only about men's fashion. There's, there's a whole lot of ladies' ranges as well. Yes, I'm, I'm actually personally looking forward to the Jenny and Maru Habits fashion mm -hmm. show. I mean, she always brings out a spectacular show. Um, also, obviously, the one to watch is the Gavin Rogers mm -hmm. show. As mentioned before, he hasn't done it for two years, and I believe it's interviewing him on Thursday yeah, Express. So. Yes, I mm -hmm. believe it's invite only, mm -hmm. so it's definitely going. If you've got that ticket, it's the hottest ticket in town. And then also um, David Tali, I mm -hmm. think, is also coming up. I also would love to watch um, his show. That's going and then, of course, Saturday night, Fabiani at 8:30. Yes, absolutely. We're looking forward to that. It's mm -hmm. going to be absolutely. Well, guys, amazing. thank you so much for joining us, and stay with us here on Expresso. We're going to find out what you've got to say about the fashion, the hair, and everything else here on Expresso.